Okay, so I thought what might be useful is that we have a little look at the vampire drain that I've been experiencing. I have a Tesla Powerwall 2. I've just had a brand new Smets meter put in. I am with Octopus Energy on the Agile Tariff. Uh, basically what is happening, so this is for the week. The in-home display is showing a consumption of 51.55 kilowatt hours. And if I look at the app for the Powerwall across the same period, you can see here that we've actually used 21.7 kilowatt hours from the grid. Um, this is quite a significant difference when it comes to charging. So we're being charged just this week alone, 30 kilowatt hours extra. Now I've also exported 28.5 kilowatt hours to the grid. Um, although that is not what I'm looking at here because the in-home display does not meter or does not measure that. Um, so when you're looking at this, what you also want to be looking at is perhaps um, individual usage. So at the moment, we can go back to right now. Let's go back to the day. Um, so what we're showing here is at this exact point in time, we are using, according to the in-home display, 143 watts. But if we actually look at the power flow, which we have into the power wall from the solar panels, we're generating half a watt, sorry, half a kilowatt, uh, and 0.1 watts, 100 watts is effectively coming into the house, and 0.4 kilowatts is being stored in the power wall. So again, you can see where this disparity is coming in. So we're totally off grid at the moment. We're pulling no power at all here from the, from the grid, as you can see, nothing being pulled from the grid. But when you look at the display, effectively the meter reading, the, the remote for the meter, um, we're actually pulling 136 watts. So again, this is a good way to find out where the disparity is coming in. Um, so obviously multiply this up across the, the hours, the weeks, the months, and the year, it does up, add up to quite a lot of money, yeah, potentially compared to the cost of electricity. Okay, hopefully you found this useful. It's just an indicator and what I would suggest is you take it up with your energy supplier. Uh, the old meter was a Landis and Gur, that's been removed and we've had a new one put in, but also, as you can see, it's still not um, working as it should do. Thanks for watching.